Welcome to episode one of the Sequoia Symphony Orchestra's musical Uplink series. We start our series with a short selection by one of the best American composers that you probably haven't yet heard of. After studying in Paris for two years with the famous teacher Nadia Boulanger, Walter Piston returned to his native Boston and spent the next several decades teaching at Harvard. His students there included a virtual who's who of American composers, everyone from Leroy Anderson to Elliot Carter, along with some kid named uh, Leonard Bernstein. An active composer in his own right, he was commissioned alongside many of the greatest, uh, Aaron Copland, William Grant Still, and others. Today, however, Piston is best known as a composition teacher and as the author of four great textbooks on counterpoint, harmony, and a particularly well-regarded book on orchestration. I myself have referred to this orchestration textbook on many occasions in my own work. Today, we hear one of my favorite pieces of his, but not one of his best known. From 1946, we hear the first movement of his divertimento for nine instruments. A divertimento is usually a casually light and entertaining work, a diversion. And you certainly get that here, although this movement in particular seems inspired by a folk dance with playful and energetic rhythms throughout. Somewhat unusual for a composer, Piston actually orchestrated as he composed, rather than the traditional habit of writing a piano sketch and then assigning the lines to various instruments. And you can almost hear the result, music that is interesting in each of the nine players' parts. Rarely is there a sense that any note is unimportant or just an accompaniment to something else that's going on. Instead, every instrument has interesting, playful, and yes, even sometimes tricky musical material that keeps everyone paying attention throughout this short and buoyant opening movement. <laughs> 